Hi, my name's Philip Higgins. I'm with uh, Thode Knife and Saw, or Thode Canada, based in Chilliwack. We just set up a factory down there, and we are the iSally agents for Canada. So we're here with the machine at the show. This is a BMP 200, which is a bandsaw profile grinder, uh, the latest tech. And um, it's, uh, this particular one is a three axis CNC grinder. Uh, the machine comes out as a two axis as well, uh, but the three axis has some advantages over that machine. This machine has uh, got a wheel dresser on it if you were using a uh, vitrified wheel, so you can dress those, but the CBN wheel runs without any dressing at all. So, you know, they may last for a number of years as they do in a lot of cases. Uh, we know of some that have been running for six years without being changed and the shape remains fine, they don't need profiling and they just keep cutting cleanly, they're really good. So that's the wheel that is supplied by our Sally as well for these machines. Really it's the simplicity of it, um, with the machine all the working parts uh, in the front of the machine is uh, limited, so just what has to be there is there and uh, yeah, it just doesn't wear out and uh, from grinding particles getting in there, it was protected from that. Very easy to keep clean and uh, all the working parts are in the back of the machine. Simplicity of operation, the, uh, the screen on the machine, very much like all the iSally machines, so uh, self-explanatory with um, just going from the various screens, uh, that's the automatic run. Uh, various speed controls, it's the uh, various teeth designs that are in there already, you can have up to 9,000 and then it has a, um, a sonic sensing system on there so the machine will set itself to the tooth so you don't have to adjust it, you can put in the amount of material you want taken off the tooth set it up on the system, press go and the wheel will come in and set itself to the tooth through Sonic Sound. So the setup is uh, very simple, uh, putting the saw onto the machine, um, it has a tooth height stop on it, so it's really a matter of sitting it in the, uh, in the cradle or the, the carriage, pressing a button until it stops coming up and it will be set at the correct height and then more or less sets itself from there as well. So very simple and moving from one saw to the next is just seconds and easy.